continuing right along now, it's my pleasure to introduce to you St. Andrew's United Church Choir. Bert Ramsey, I work at St. Andrew's United Church where it's my joy to stand near this choir most Sundays. They're going to sing a song that Alan Pote wrote um, for survivors of Hurricane Ivan about the human privilege and responsibility of creating home for each other. A good December thought, and one fittingly called then, we will be a shelter for each other. notion of standing here at a multi-faith 
multicultural gathering and presuming to speak on behalf of the entirety of what's left of Christendom, like some kind of Protestant hope. But it, um, it became less daunting when it, it dawned upon my gray head that I could simply be honest with you and tell you that first of all, I don't know much about Christianity in general, nor in particular about this thing Christians do around this time of year, this Christmas thing. Uh, for one thing, uh, I don't know when exactly Christmas should be celebrated, for no one knows exactly when Jesus of Nazareth was born. The early Christians didn't worry about it much since they thought that all time was hallowed anyway. So maybe it was winter, maybe it was spring, but I don't know. And nobody knows either exactly where Christmas began. Uh, some scholars stay with tradition and say that it was Bethlehem. Others say Nazareth. My own peculiar New Testament prof argued for some reason that it just had to be Jerusalem. But then somebody else said it doesn't matter anyway because all ground is holy ground and in that sense everywhere is Bethlehem. So I don't know. But you know, it doesn't particularly bother me, this not knowing. Um, for it seems to me that, that the absence of knowledge leaves room for wonder, which is maybe a better thing than knowing. And it's certainly better suited to a story about shepherds standing astonished under a sky full of light. So perhaps the best thing I can do tonight, aside from being silent, is, is wishing the whole blessed lot of us a season of wonder and peace and goodwill. And to that, I think the choir is going to sing Amen. <laughs> 